Alrighty, what is up everybody? Welcome back to uh, my my document, me documenting my bomb surgery. Um, it's your boy Matt Turner. Um, and officially I am two months post-op RFF phalloplasty with Dr. Santucci of the Crane Center. Um, I wanted to just do like a quick update because it's been a while. Um, I had my um, voiding trials have been going great since then. Um, the only thing that I had that occurred was that I noticed I had an active healing site underneath um, in the scrotum area. That's all healed up. That's doing good. That's gone and everything and then um i had what's known as slough which is um kind of like a fibrous usually sometimes yellowish um sometimes wet um tissue that will separate necrotic tissue from granulation tissue um, i had that on the tip of the phallus that cleared up um and so that's all healed up now for the most part um and so now I'm, I'm back to working out. I am back to um, going to school full time and just living life and everything like that. Um, not too much has been going on, honestly. Sensation is not fully returned um, in either one of my um, surgery sites. Um, my arm, this is my arm right now. I have a uh, silicone sheets that I am putting on it to help smooth it out. I've been wearing this for about three days and I think it's been making a difference. It's much easier to maintain and um, uh, care for than the strips that I was using for um, my top surgery scars. So there's that. Um, so in that sense, the silicone sheet for this one works just fine and it helps that you can buy it in the, or I could buy it in the exact size of the entire, um, section, which is five by nine for me. Um, so nine inches at around five inches, uh, in width. Um, and then, um, I've been running. I've I've gone running already. Um, so I'm really just working back up my strength for weightlifting. Um, and I am, you know, just going to school and handling day-to-day -day life situations. Um, how do I feel about everything? I think this was probably one of the best decisions I've ever made. Honestly, um, it just feels so relieving to just like a be done and be done but also to finally just not be second guessing myself or um you know struggling through certain situations like it's very simple for me to just kind of be myself um and enjoy life and enjoy doing things so that's one of the things that i i am definitely super happy to have now that I am post-op and I'm I'm back to kind of out of the uh you know the big window for healing and it's kind of just from here just the long haul um but yeah no no regret no regrets no regrets um what what are my plans going forward um, so for those who don't know, I had um, scrotoplasty, phalloplasty, urethroplasty, and um, nerve hookup, and um, yeah, that's it. I think that's everything. And burial. Um, so I had all of that done in stage one. So technically speaking, I am um, finished. That was my goal. That's what I wanted. Um, I originally did want to go with implants. Um, I'm still doing research on that because there is, can be a lot of, um, misconceptions, a lot of rumors out there. So 
Going in these next few stages, if I decide to have any of them, I don't think I'm gonna try and have glansplasty anymore. I think I can just find a really good tattoo artist. And I think that'll be enough for me, honestly, um, especially since I've done some mock-ups myself using um, like Clip Studio Art. So you can use art softwares. Um, and I've done mock-ups of what um, like medical tattooing might look like. So I'm pretty happy in that sense. Um, that I won't need glansplasty because it's not that big of a deal for me. Um, mainly, I am just going to be waiting for um, if I do do anything testicle implants, I think I'm going to hold out for at least a year to two years before I consider um, erectile devices. Um, but I think I would like implants, but I'm not sure when they're, I would get them. And so from here on out, it's kind of just me, um, just kind of being like, uh, you know, yeah, I, I want some implants. Um, I don't really have a timeline on it. I don't consider it to be part of my overall journey. It's more of just kind of like a thing that I would want to have done, um, in the future if I, it allows it, but otherwise I'm content. But yeah. Um, now it's just, I'm just, honestly, I'm just living life, um, enjoying it finally to the most that I can. Um, I feel like I left out a lot of information. Um, but you know, you know me, I am on Reddit. If you want to find me, you can find me. Um, I'm always open to answer questions. Um, you can drop questions down below and maybe I'll do a Q&A of anything. Um, but yeah, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification button so you guys can stay up to date on when I post videos. Um, and it's your boy, Matt Turner. I hope you guys um, had a great day wherever you are, morning, evening, day or night. And I will see you guys later.